Thompson had just checked in for her Virgin Airlines flight in LAX's Terminal 3 when the unthinkable happened. Probably like seven to nine shots, I think, and I just started running. I just dropped everything and ran. And I headed into this, like, office with some security people, and then found Tammy, and then we all just, everyone just started, like, stampeding out and, like, running. Once safe inside the security office, the St. Mary's and University of Oregon graduate thought she was safe, but soon the fear returned. They shut the door and locked it, and someone was knocking on the door, and so it was really scary. I thought it would have, like, been a shooter. But, um, they didn't let anybody in, and then I think it was just another security person, but that's just when I texted my mom and said, that, you know, there's shooting going on in the airport, I'm safe, I'm hiding, you know, love you, whatever, but yeah, it's really scary. Hours later, Thompson's safe and counting her blessings while reliving the story with her family here in Medford. Oh my God, I can't believe the sounds of the shots are like unreal. Like you hear about this happening all the time, but it was so crazy, it's so loud. Thompson was one of the last to be released from the lockdown late this afternoon. She doesn't have her carry-ons. Police say they're not reopening Terminal 3 anytime soon. Her New York trip remains in limbo, so she's walking away from LAX, unsure what happens next. Like you've never felt before, like your heart beat that fast. But she's thankful to be alive. In Medford, Craig Smullen, NBC5 News.